All right, hello everyone. Uh, this is Bob again. Um, I'm a comic artist, and uh, for this episode, I am going to show off a little of the comic that I drew. Now, I'm not going to go through the whole thing page by page. I'm not sure that the person who paid me to draw the book would appreciate me putting the entire book out on YouTube to be seen. Um, considering that he's still selling the book. Uh, so you would be able to go into several comic stores in New Jersey and purchase this book. Uh, this is Witches of Westchester number one. I did this a few years ago. Um, now, I did not do this cover. This cover is by someone else. So there was a lot of our alternative covers to the book. Um, the weird thing with that is that I originally did a um an interior cover here that showed all of the characters and their names um in the video i'm going to add that so that you'll be able to see it uh with this it looks like somebody just went in and and just put you know this simple thing on the inside here um but here are some of the pages um from this book uh i'm going to skip ahead for some because uh, again, I don't want to show everything that's in here, but I am the person who I had to do everything. So uh, I will just go right here because we're getting to, hold on, we're getting to a point now nah, it's going to be further down the road here. Uh, let's see, here we go. All right, so I'll just show a few pages from here. Um, there was not a lot of action in the book and... Uh, you know, most of what I do would be considered superhero type art, and it would, you know, revolve around a lot of action. Uh, so, this was the only action scene in the comic, and, you know, I decided to try to throw my all in there. Now, I do want to say that, again, I was the penciler, the inker, the colorist, and the letterer. Uh, that's a lot of work on one person to do for a comic, and to be honest... You, you're, you saw another, uh, you know, video I made showing off the book that I drew, uh, my mini comic. And you can see that the artwork in here, in my opinion, was better than what you're getting here. Um, and it's mostly because I just had too much on my plate. On my plate. Uh, it's, a, it's a lot to do for just one person. Um, but I pulled it off and uh, I got the book out on time. Um, you know, uh Seems to have done pretty good. I actually did draw Witches of Westchester 2. I have not received a copy of that yet. I believe it's because um, the writer of the book is having issues with the printer. So uh, once that has happened and I receive my comp, I will do another video showcasing some of the artwork in that. Um, you know, this uh, is about a group of witches. Think, think Harry Potter but with um, college-age women. So they're, uh, you know, witches that attend a college in Westchester. Uh, the redhead woman you see here is their professor who apparently also teaches them in witchcraft. Um, it's an okay comic. Uh, I enjoy it. Um, hopefully anybody else who have seen it or anything uh, can talk about it, but I just wanted to show a little bit of what I've done. And to be honest, this was the first completed and published work of mine. Um, so again, uh, leave some comments and please like and subscribe. I'm going to be working on um, my own comic, which is called Ghost Girl, and I'm trying to get my name out there. Uh, I will be doing a Kickstarter, uh, hopefully this summer, for that book when it's completed. Uh, so again, like and subscribe. Also tell your friends. Thank you.